what is a fantasy football slow draft? Well, I just learned, so I'm here to talk about it. A fantasy football slow draft is a great way to extend the best day of the year, fantasy football draft day. And it also helps out when you have 12 different people's schedules that you're trying to align, it always seems like somebody has an auto draft or somebody's clock expired and they're angry or whatever. You get rid of all of that nonsense and you basically set it up, have the draft order, and then you put your picks into some sort of a chat, some sort of a thread. We use Discord, but you literally could use like a text thread, you could use a Google Doc. Like you, there's so many different ways that you could get creative with it to be putting the picks in. Have a text thread to let somebody know, hey, you're on the clock at 107. Go ahead and take, boom, Jonathan Taylor, Nick Chubb, whoever it is, whatever guy is available, you have the time. There's no more worrying about, oh no, the clock's gonna run out, I have to do all this. If you're out with the family, or you're eating dinner, or maybe you get caught on the crapper, although that might be a great time to make a pick. It doesn't, it doesn't matter. Now this draft is a bit more work for the league commissioner, but I mean, face it, we're heroes. We just don't wear capes. We're willing to do it. And I think in the long run, you'll see that if you do have trouble getting everybody together for one day, this is a good solution. My one tip would be, just don't draft too early, but go ahead, play around with the idea, toss it out to your league mates if you guys are arguing about which day you're gonna draft on, what time it's gonna be. I have to draft from my phone, at work, in the rain, uphill, both ways, come on. Another great thing is that you never get that shook feeling. You know when you're on the clock and the guy right before you steals your pick? <laughs> Don't worry about that, that happened to me. I was on the clock in round two, about to pick CEH, Boom, the guy in front of me took him. I took my time to make my next pick. You don't have to be forced and frazzled and just take a running back just because you were going to take a running back. You can pivot. You have time to think clearly. It's one of the great parts about a slow draft. My name is Tony Tucker, and I want to thank you for stopping by the Warzone Sports Network to talk about the slow draft process. I hope you enjoy it. Please hit the subscribe button on the Warzone Sports Network for tons of great fantasy content.